Good morning. Hi, friend. Hi, friend. It's my birthday today. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and we are standing on a lovely place. Uchon in France. Uchon, and it's on the top of a hill. And we really experienced that it's on the top of a hill because the road to here was really an adventure, wasn't it, Anthony? 18% elevation, uh, elevation change. So this little Mercedes, first gear. Small roads <laughs> with a lot of trees and uh, yeah. It was really... Uh, it was quite the adventurous week. But we had another adventure here. <laughs> Several. <laughs> <laughs> Several adventures here <laughs> that we want to share with you. We had, uh, we woke up with uh, well, little itching things um, on our arms and on my back and in my face. And, uh, and every morning we woke up and it felt like we were bitten more and more often. Something is biting us. Something is biting us. So we don't know what it is, but we first thought it were bad bugs, but that's not possible because we're not living in a hotel though it feels that way sometimes <laughs> <laughs> but yeah we really don't know what it is maybe it's uh just um dust dust, dust mites dust maybe mites, maybe and, and we're we, so clean we have an allergic how is reaction. that possible <laughs> we are so clean we're really clean but uh, we don't know what we done yesterday is cleaning the camper we were sleeping uh, in two sleeping bags which were 35 years old so mm -hmm. could be that the heat of the last week is um, is encouraging <laughs> them to come out <laughs> we don't know but what we're going to do um, we are leaving this place today and uh, we are going for a laundry but the old sleeping bags we are going to throw them away yes bye <laughs> bye sleeping bags thank and you very much for your service we'll all buy, those years <laughs> we buy some new ones and a new towel um or a blanket hopefully it's gone then hopefully it's done and well after that if it's not done we have to do some other things um, we try not to do it on the um uh, well the chemical way mm -hmm. we want to do it in an organic way so we have read something about baking soda things that works to get them out but i hope really hope that the problem is solved and as soon as we threw our, our sleeping bags outside we have not been bitten again so hopefully the problem is solved <laughs> but of course if you have any suggestions what it could be then please let us know in the comments and then maybe you can help us out finding the yeah. trouble. Furthermore, this week we had uh, very hot weather when we were at my uh, uncle and aunt. Uh, it was very hot, it was almost 40 degrees. So this is the terrace of my uh, uncle and aunt, the brother of my father, and this is their garden. You can see it's very hot today. And uh, I, it, I, I suppose it's 36 degrees. And they got sunflowers and a lot of lovely plants. And now my aunt is preparing the food. And this is my family name. And look inside. Here I have the floor. I love the floor. And there's the table. The family and this is Anthony's new office. He's hidden behind the computer. Hi Anthony. So look at this. This used to be an old barn. And they all decorated it, restored it. So it's a great house. And this uh, cupboard used to stand in my uh, grandparents' home. Yeah, 
in the first part of the video, we're mainly in the Netherlands, our homeland. And, and that's my voice, you hear my voice twice. <laughs> because Anthony is editing our videos. In the first part of the video, After two days we left there it was a very cozy time and we've been to uh, uh, someone uh, in the garden uh, with uh, Frans Passion and the guide uh, which is very helpful after that we've been to uh, a little uh, or a little uh, an abbey uh, but the abbey was unfortunately closed so we couldn't visit it we had a lovely walk though the weather was a lot better maybe um, because it's 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 higher here i don't know we were totally off grid yeah. uh, there was no uh, signal for the for the phone <laughs> so we didn't have internet for like 24 hours it was totally secluded in the woods and it was a beautiful place after that we've been to a spot with a pizzeria we couldn't find the parking where we had to stay for the night first but later on we found a parking place next to an abandoned uh, midget golf uh, course um, which was very funny because we had still some laundry to dry and we made our own uh, washing line to put everything on <laughs> <laughs> so that was very funny and of course we've eaten pizza, pizza. very good pizza it was Italian. very good it was very good after that we were at a wine chateau uh, which was a beautiful place also and they had lovely wines not that cheap but very good very good it was in fact the first vineyard that we came across because now we are in wine territory yes so that's a, that's a beautiful thing they also had a labyrinth in the garden to uh, someone who was making uh, nat natural paint, organic paint, uh, but unfortunately he wasn't home either. So we uh, moved on the next day to this place and we've, seen, we've been here for two days and it's really a magic place with all kind of uh, French stone hanches. <laughs> 